So we figured out why Perplexity's data has been so good, because they're stealing it. So earlier this week, ChatGPT was in data privacy issues, and now Perplexity has said, hold my beer. So Cloudflare, a big security company that monitors a bunch of websites and protects a lot of websites, a human button that's usually from Cloudflare, they published an article yesterday talking about how perplexity has been bypassing the very bots I talked about yesterday that protect your data from being scraped on various websites. Now, this doesn't affect your personal data but so much, but if you've got a website and you've got private sections of your website, then you're going to want to tap into this. So if you've got a website that's private, you can mark it as no follow. You can put in the robot TXT for the um, website crawlers not to be able to crawl it. And now it comes to find out that Perplexity has been doing something that they can bypass those settings. And one of the things that I've read that they were doing was making themselves look like a regular user going to a site, which is illegal for bots. They want bots. They want to know if it's a bot because they want to make sure your, your data is secure. So now Cloudflare is trying to block all perplexity crawlers, which means they won't be the best anymore, not just because they won't be able to steal, but now they won't even be able to get the stuff that they could get. And so that is going to cause a huge issue and definitely all of these things, ChatGPT, perplexity, and we'll see who's next because I'm sure there is one, are all going to impact how AI is able to get data, how it's able to use data, and even how it has to now start attrib giving attribution to data. This AI saga is ongoing. You need to follow me to stay aware.